I'm things moving, right? Okay, good. Sometimes you got to make sure that things work. And I'd hate to do this video here and it'd be effed up. Listen, people, you want to know what the perfect dog is, what makes a great dog, how to, to, to bring up. Bible says raise up a child, train up a child in the way that he should go. And when he gets old, he will not depart. Amen. There you go. You see what I'm saying? I'm going to tell you why Ego is probably one of the best dogs I have. And mind you, I just started liking this joker. To be clear, we're going to go through a couple different phases so you can see why he's good outdoors, why he's good in the home, and why he's great for playtime. He has three different levels of energy, <laughs> and the energy is inspired or it spikes, it peaks depending on what we're doing. He's going to come out when we first go let him out and be excited to see Stan's going to jump around. Stan's going to bring out a treat, energy going to drop a little bit, like I don't want to do that, but I'll do it. And we're going to just again work through his intelligence. Shout out to all you people who are paying attention. I got to say this, and we're going to keep this short and get right to it. I know people think that the dog is supposed to listen every time you say something. I would listen to nobody the first time they said something. I don't need my dogs to be that perfect. Nine out of ten, look at this. We're in a residential area right here, people. Nine out of ten people in these homes have a dog. They're not like this. Sit down, stay, lay. They don't do that. You know what they enjoy? They enjoy the honest process of an imperfect dog and a human being working together. When we watched the movie I Am Legend, was it the sit down, lay us there? Was it the fact that he had a companion, a trusted animal, something he valued? And we love that, we love that bond. Whole movie almost, him against some aliens and a German Shepherd. That movie's legendary, despite what Will Smith has done. <laughs> So when I'm bringing up dogs, training up dogs, I put in their information cells, per se, we'll call it that. The capacity to learn. So if you want to take them to do whatever, they can. If you want them to chill in the house, they can. If you want them to do bite work, they can. But the question is, what can you do? So Stan's going to work through some of Ego's intelligence, talk a little bit about training, why he enjoys training. Even more importantly, you'll see the levels. Watch level one, he's just doing dog training. You mean to bring treats out? Okay, he's got the trees. Let me let the cracking out. <laughs> yeah, we stay, come out up. Watch. We stay strapped up. <laughs> what up, Ego? Get the big boy. Get the big boy. Hey, where's it at? Where's it at? He, he thinks we about to play. Yep. Look at them toys. Who's your baby tree down? <laughs> See what I'm saying? See, look, he like, where's it at, man? I want no dang tree. What we gonna do today, Ego? <laughs> So what I'm going to do first is something that I would do if I'm bringing a dog out and I want to train with somebody else. As I sit down, calm down, make sure he knows that I have, I'm not involved. You ain't got nothing to do with this. I ain't got nothing to do with it. So he's going to go to his thing. And he's still looking for it. He's like, uh-uh. I let him go through his thing. Look, your dog got to work through his energies too, just like you do. And then he realized, okay. Is this what we're doing? So that's one thing you want to do is let your dog come out, let him go to the bathroom, let him sniff around because when you are working with him, you want them to be focused on you. Let him go to the bathroom, get it all out. Because <laughs> think about it, have you ever wanted to do something but you got to go pee? You don't want to do anything besides going pee. So same thing with him. Let it get it all out. Just need to poop. And, and again, he's wired up. He thinks it's playtime when he sees Stan, so you've got to manage your energies. And somebody will see him come out, didn't I say sit, get over here. He's not going to do that. And right now, he's got to work through his stuff. Now he's getting into that. What are we doing? Hmm. See, he's calm. Yes. Sit. Oh, that's good. Free. Good job. That's good. Good job, Mr. Good job. Good job. What are we doing? How's his downs? Uh, it's manageable. It's manageable. I ain't had him in a few days, so you know how it goes. Oh, so he's going to be pretty amped up. Yeah. yeah. When I'm working with a dog, I like to give an end point to let them know when they are finished with that command because we want our dogs to understand that they have to hold that position until they get released. You ready? Down. Free. Oh, good. Also, one thing you want to do is mix up which hand you reward him with because the dogs will start anticipating. You saw when I came back and gave him the release command, he wanted to go to the right. So that's why we fed him with the left. Yes, go. You want to try again? Sit. Free. 
Good job. Yes, a boy. Good. Yes, a let your dog know they're doing things right. Let them know you enjoy it when they're chilling, when they're doing absolutely nothing. Let's see. Now again, people, what you're seeing right here is you saw Ego get calm for the most part, and he realized, okay, we're doing tree training. Look, go show. And I mind, mind you, I built in this, this intelligence so you can get the dogs to do anything. And the, 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 the first key is really showing drive. You need a driven dog to be a great dog. Back, 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 back. <laughs> <laughs> way. There you go. Back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. There you go. Good job. Good job. You ready? Let's go. Back. Back, back. Oh, good job, Bubba. Uh -huh. Good job. Yeah. You're watching. Now, mind you, I've done minimal to nothing with this dog, but I did a lot, if I'm being honest. And what I did was just put it in his ideas. It's like somebody keeps programming you to do this, do that. Make sure you steal him. Yep. You go, wow, that's interesting. Good boy, good boy, and the dog keeps getting married. But look at that focus. See how dialed in his eyes are? Yeah. <laughs> Front. Free. Good job, Bubba. Oh, See that right there, people? And I love just sitting back and watching the dogs. Look, we're going to continue to build out stuff and teaching you how to manage a pit bull, a bully, terrier type breeds, communication, building communication. That right there is that tuck. That's the one I really want to learn. I say tuck, I want him to. <laughs> Getting used to walking through the legs. Stan be over there doing a dance with that boy. Good job. <laughs> yes, a big boy. Yes, a big boy. Come on. That's the point. This is the kind of stuff I enjoy the most, man. Just watching my dog get better. It ain't always got to be me. It ain't never got to be me. But I'm always love the dog the most. And that's why when I need him to do something, they're going to do it. Good boy. Heel. Come on, finish it. There you go, good boy. Down. <laughs> Free. Yeah, my boy. You get it. Look that's at that. Great. That's great. <laughs> Yeah, it's funny because he's usually a lot more amped up, but he realizes we're not playing right now. We're just going through the intelligent side of this, and he's just like, okay, okay. Look, he's still looking yeah, like he's oh, looking for it, but he's in a stuff, common man. state of mind. I ain't come out here for this, but that's what I'm talking about. When you build in your bully or your program, I've got three phases of the dogs. Now, mind you, in a second, we're gonna get the pillow, and you will see a different dog. Mind you, you see how he's just having a good time, and life is good. When I bring that pillow out, he'll be like. <laughs> he gonna be wired up, but this is the stuff that you gotta practice. You gotta practice this stuff all the time. Here. <laughs> he went back, his butt was back too. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go. Tuck. Yeah, tuck. There it is. Free. That's a good boy. Let's try one more time. One more, <laughs> one more and we're done. Stay tuned, people. Part two coming next. Tuck. tuck.